Right, so what's up guys? Right now you can see a bin and maybe even you can hear a dog. But that's all about to change now. You can see my arm. Now you can see my leg. Now you can see my face. But now it's time for what we're really here for. That is to move the camera. And yes, this is one of my new series. And that is going to... Now I actually asked a few kids in school. Because if you haven't seen the vlog, I suggest you go and see it. Vlog, happy birthday, aunt. That's what it's called. So I need you guys to go and check that out. Now, what I did was built a roller coaster now. As you can probably make out... I've done more roller coasters since. Alright, let's just show you, go and show you this. Right, so this is the first roller coaster. It's got a tunnel, it's got a big lift drop, and it's got Hayley and 30 in the middle because that's how hard my aunt is. She's a teacher. So that was the first ever roller coaster successfully built by myself. But then we move over to this monstrosity. Now this monstrosity only has one pig going round, but we're going to join this piggy to show you what this roller coaster is. Now, if you haven't been on Oblivion, you might want to go and see it, as this is oh, that hasn't worked. I want to knock that pig. Right, so the pig works. Why didn't I work? Right, hang on. Let me just put myself in this cart here. Right, let's go. Where the hell did that go there? Sorry, pig. Right, so then we're going to go up and then turn that way. And let's see if this works this time. This is my second ever roller coaster built. Yes, and it works. Look at that. Now, this is basically a Bolivian remake. Now, we're going to jump out that. And hopefully get it before it drops. Oh, it won't drop anyway. It's got nothing in. So, then we move on to our second ever roller coaster built. Now, this is the exact same as that, but smaller. So, yeah. Let's go. Check if the pigs are. No, it's not. And then we drop down into water for a brief moment. And then we're done, Zod. I'm actually going to stop this pig by doing this, putting a block. And then we're actually going to do this like this. So we kill the pig. Now he just should actually just rebound back, so I'm just gonna stand here and wait to smack him once more. There you go. Right, so what I'm actually gonna need to do is go back down where I have actually done it, and then basically go up, put water buckets here. Although. What, what's the point when I can just do it straight from the top? So yeah, let's do this by spawning minecart here, spawning pig right there, pushing the pig over to here, and then we push the minecart, which sends him into the minecart, and then we go. Hopefully this works first time for you guys. And yes, it does. Now let's actually drop down into it. Yeah, you go quite far. Wait. Oh. There you go, little piggy. So there you go, that's my second, third ever roller coaster built. And it works like a charm. Now, this little contraption here is like a maze trap. And oblivion for little kids. So as you can see, we've got this little drop here. And it literally is for little kids. Now, 
if you haven't already got what I'm doing, yeah, right here. Uh, let me just dig up here. We've got a pig. It won't die, so I'm not just gonna kill him. So this is actually where my first pig died, very sadly. I'm actually gonna keep that diamond block with a sign on there. R.I.P. Piggy from 21st of Feb till the 23rd. So yeah, so those are my four roller coasters built so far. But now we actually need is see where these guys are going. Um, this is what we need to do. So if you haven't got what I'm doing yet, you are done probably. But Tappy and Rowit know exactly what I'm doing. Some of my mates at school who were my first subscribers. Now I can't actually in fact do these stairs. It's going to have to be a ladder for the drop roller coasters. For the entrance. Oh crap. For the entrance to the ride. Now I'm not actually going to tell you what this project is. And what it's going to be called. Till this video is released. I'll do a vlog about it. So I'm actually going to call it Minecraft Returns in creative, but as I said, this is going to be a new series, and then I will do a vlog about it. Alright, now we're just reaching the top here, so then we get to here, where we've got this cross section, and then what I'm actually going to want to do is do this. Change this block to this, because then you're going to go, whoa, oh, and then you're welcomed by a lovely overhead little thing here, and then for the exit, um, I haven't actually thought about the exit, um, I reckon I should just do this. Just do this, I should say. So then that gets destroyed and then we go. Although, can I actually get under here? No, nope, so here and here. Way. Safety boundary. Yep, now we can get off. So then we can just go back under guys and then do it like so now. This has actually been the first Minecraft video I've done in ages. And I'm so happy that I'm getting this done and out for you guys. Now if you haven't actually found out what I'm doing. Do you know what I'm actually going to say? To keep the tents at bay. It is theme park junkie building. That is not actually going to be the park's name. But as you can see, we've got four rides in this theme park so far that are all going to be linked up by path. If you don't know what the path is, I'm not actually going to tell you. Although, let's actually have a look at blocks now. I'm, rec I'm thinking we do uh, stone bricks with a mixture of never bricks that we ain't got it just all boring it's all mixed up and it's gonna be a free wide path you know just for the wheelchair users accessibility but there's no not actually gonna be any wheelchair users in this part like we are actually gonna have a walker who will help like by carrying if it's a kid we'll get a walker to carry him if it's an adult I don't know what we're gonna do if it's an adult see cuz people in wheelchairs can't actually walk up these stairs but do you know what 
let's carry on by doing it a loop round once more now like do you know how I've been saying about wheelchair users hey that it's gonna be a bit of a problem with them on the roads well it won't be so much of a problem but like it will be a struggle for them they I'm sorry but if I'm offending you right now I'm so sorry I'm not trying to offend anyone if you're a wheelchair user that's f okay because one of my friends is actually a wheelchair user so I'm not actually mocking them but things like the oblivion road and the one that drops into water that are vertical they will not be able to go on like because I they can't climb the ladder and then I don't want to get sued on this park parks premises I don't want anyone to die that happened I would be in big trouble big 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 trouble with the ha safety inspectors a safety inspectors do, 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 do. so there we've got the entrance to this road where we go up do you know what I'm actually going to take the pigs off soon because we don't really need them on this one but then we've got here do you know what I'm actually going to build this up so yeah so then we've got this road I should really be going down the exit. Um, so yeah, here's the exit. Yep, well that was good. How are we going to suss that? Oh well. Uh, yeah, that's actually a problem. See, because people could just jump and commit suicide on here. So, I'll think about that off camera. But anyway, let's carry on with the entrances and exits. Now, this one's not very fancy. So, yeah, I'm actually going to get rid of this one. And change the whole floor into grass. I mean, wood half slabs by the way btw and probably you guys all know what that is btw or by the way i may as well just say by the way but anyway we are this is actually going to be probably a very successful series this project here but anyway I hope you guys like this because it's going to take me a lot longer to do more roller coasters. I think to add to the excitement of you, for you guys, I will <coughs> I will build all roller coasters on camera. I repeat, I will build all roller coasters on camera for you guys, and I hope that makes you happy. So if it doesn't, tough titties. You can suck my, not to say it properly. But anyway, we are just going to patch all this up where glass is actually broken. Do you know what? We've got to extend here. So what I'm actually going to need to do is this. See, because it needs to be too wide. Because then we can have a two in the middle gap. Although it's going to be a three in the middle gap. So yeah, right now the pigs are literally my test on these to see if the... Uh oh. Oh no. Pig! I'm so sorry. Uh... Carry on. Oh, he's not going to make it. Uh, pig, do you just halt and go that way and bounce back? So that's just an easy way of getting them back on the uh, dropping part, part proper. 
Anyway, we actually need to get rid of them two bits, and then we need to continue. And go on. Right. So, oh crap! But anyway, I think I might actually finish this in the next episode. So stay tuned for that, guys. And yeah, I have been the Delta Hacksaws, and this has been the first episode of Hayden Builds an Amusement Park. So in a bit, guys. And see you later. Just to wrap it out. There you go. And bye. Good night. Good evening. Have a nice night. And in a bit.